right, uh, back here at Stevens Stadium, Santa Clara, California. Second overtime. BYU 2 and Santa Clara 2. Broncos scored the first two goals of this game. BYU equalizing. One in the first, one in the second. We're now in the second OT. Ten more minutes to play. BYU coming in 10-0. and Santa Clara coming in 6-5. and And again, a sub storyline is BYU playing for its first ever three-point result here at Stevens Stadium. BYU will switch sides of the pitch. Take it left to right as we see it and you hear it. Santa Clara defends the goal to our right. Broncos get the first touch here of OT number two. As they go right to left, referee Ian Anderson looking at his watch. And waiting to get us restarted here. BYU victimized, but uh, by a dubious offsides call in the first overtime. There's the whistle. We're underway. Kelsey Hedge in the middle third. Challenged immediately by Cam Tucker. BYU doing all it can to get three. And go 11-0 for the first time since 1996. Last time they were 10-0. They didn't get a result in their next game. That was in 1997. So 10-0 start, ties for the second best ever start from BYU to open the season. Sarasio with a nice step up, nod down, and plays ahead to Elise Flake. Flake has players to her right and left. One left and two right, plays wide right, and that ball never got to Cam Tucker, played out by the Broncos. BYU will throw on the near side, Rachel Lyman to do the honors. Lyman bouncing into Shepard. Back to Lyman on the near touch line. Plays to Brock Bank with space at 50 yards. Centrally, Gwynn. Gwynn. Rolls it back to Brockbank at 25 yards. Ashton to the top of the area. Ball loose for Flake. Ashton's in an offside position. Ball never got back to her. Rebounds to Gwynn. Gwynn, Flake. A shield at the top of the D. Knocked down. No call. Play. It's a play on. Turnbow. Receives the ball with her back to goal. On the Broncos' side of the pitch. The ball's played wide right for Santa Clara. Coolahan wins the ball away from Kennedy. SJ starts a two-on-four, tries to play Elise Flake through, and too far in front of Elise. It'll be played by the keeper, Courtney Ogren. Ogren's ball to Hedge. is one touched back to the back line to Loeda. Alex Loeda off the midsection of Alyssa Jefferson at the halfway line. Now Shepard at 35 yards wide right. Jamie tugged off the ball, double-teamed, played out. Off of Shepard, says the official. Santa Clara throw in the Broncos' defensive half. We're in the 102nd minute. Second minute of the second overtime. 2-2, BYU and SCU. Near side throw for Audrey Heggert. The Broncos in no hurry right now. Hedge. To center back, Loeda. High pressure from Coulihan. Loeda wheels away from Kayla. Kayla stays with Loeda, who releases to Turnbow. Turnbow, Kennedy. Topoke win there by... Kayla. Kennedy wins it back away from Coulihan and plays Loeda. They're on their defensive 18 line right now are the Broncos. Loeda flips the pitch from right to left. Brought down out of the air at the midway line. Now the Broncos with some space for one of the few times in overtime. They look to play Kelsey Hedge through. Coming out to collect is Sabrina Davis. Racing back was Jefferson. Racing out was Davis. Sabrina collects and distributes to Brockbank. Brockbank had the ball get away from her. Does get it back. As she tries to rid herself of Purcell. Plays Coolahan. Coolahan's one touch got away from Shepard. Stepping up, though, and keeping the Cougars in possession is Jefferson. Alyssa into the attacking half. Jefferson. Wide right. Tucker. Tucker a half meg, but to the back line of Loeda. Alex Loeda in the 113th minute. Plays over the head of Hedge to Sarasio at the logo. Gwynn ropes it to Flake. Flake makes a quick turn. Flake, dispossessed, tried to poke it to Tucker on the right side. Defender got in the way. Goes to Jefferson. Jefferson, Shepard, Shepard. Has SJ wide left. The plays to Affleck on the wide left. SJ centrally Brockbank. Brockbank at 25 yards. Lost it as she tried to go to her left. And the Broncos play out to the far touch line. Cougars will throw in with Gwynn. Tossing in Affleck. The 1-2 back to Josie. 114th minute. We're in a second overtime. Affleck lays off Shepard at 50 straight away. Shepard, Jefferson. Jefferson right side of the park. Attacking half. Some space. Explores it with a pass to Tucker. Tucker turns to face. Tucker tried to send Elise through. Again, a leg pops out from the Santa Clara back line to deflect. The Broncos dealing in their defensive half right now. 
A step up from Lyman. Gets to Elise. Elise at the top of the D. Rolling it to her left. Still rolling it. Defenders converge. Tripped up. She goes down. No call. And the Broncos possess. Five minutes and change to play in the second overtime of a 2-2 match. These preseason co-favorites playing to a stalemate here. In a second overtime. Almost a giveaway by the Broncos in the midfield. They do take away or take back to the Broncos and play to the center circle. Now a turn and go from Hedge. Left wing is the play to Skylar Smith. Smith comes central to it. Plays a shot toward frame that'll bounce wide of goal, but Jefferson will come out of her frame to collect at the edge of the goal box and roll out to Lyman. Lyman centrally Jefferson. So much of the play in overtime in the attacking half for BYU. Nothing yet to show for it. 2-2 we stay. We have five minutes gone in the second overtime. Five minutes to play here in Santa Clara. Some might say five minutes to a conference championship for one of, for either of these teams. It's early but not unreasonable. These two teams expected to vie for this regular season title at the top of the table. Sabrina rolls out to Jefferson. Meet to Gwynn at left back. Gwynn, Coolahan at the halfway line. Lays off Josie on the overlap left side. Gwynn edging into the attacking half. A ball given away. To the Santa Clara defensive line. Jones ahead, Turnbow. Swing by Parcell and back to the back line. The Broncos look to build from the back in the 116th minute of a 2-2 match. In the second overtime, a little more than four minutes remain. Lyman centrally Shepard. Shepard in the center circle. To her left, Brockbank. Wider left, Affleck. SJ. Plays it to the top of the 18, but right to a Bronco. Broncos give away to BYU. Brockbank sees Shepard at 45 yards. Jamie to Michaela. Oh, tried to send Elise Flew. Didn't quite go on it. Elise was not going, and Coolahan was not passing. Lyman now. Deep cross, no one home. Right to the keep. Elise has been sitting in the starting box a couple times there, waiting to make that run into the 18. It just hasn't connected here in overtime. Yeah, those central midfielders are looking for her and the idea is there, but haven't connected just quite yet. Broncos win a loose ball battle in the neutral third. Kelsey Hedge, three and a quarter minutes remain in the second overtime. 2-2 our score. Far side of the park. Broncos down that right wing. With Parcell racing Gwynn to the end line. Cutting it back on Gwynn as Parcell. Cutting again away from Gwynn. Taking it toward the attacking right flag. Plays off of Josie. Ball stays loose and Josie recovers. Plays Affleck. Affleck to, tried to get it to Josie. Ball deflected out by the Broncos. BYU will throw in the Cougs defensive third. Two minutes, 40 seconds remain. They stop the clock to bring in a sub. We'll see what Rachel McCarthy's fresh legs can do here in the second overtime. McCarthy in and Tucker is out. They've kept the clock running here in the second overtime. BYU throws defensive third. BYU 0-6-2 here all time. 0-6-3 wouldn't feel terribly satisfying, but down 2-0 the way they were. Take a point and hope for the best the rest of the way and play for the best the rest of the way. Would be the first dent in BYU's record if they can't pull the full three. Now Rachel McCarthy has possession near side. McCarthy plays off the Broncos and out. Cougars get a throw with two minutes remaining in the second overtime. McCarthy throws past the head of Flake. It bounces to the top of the 18. Knotted down by the Broncos. Stepping up on it is Shepard. Looked for McCarthy. Sliding, sliding to it. The Broncos play out. And McCarthy will throw once again. One minute, 40 seconds remain in the second overtime. The throw in. McCarthy. Shepard. Jamie. Sending Coolahan through. Flag is up. Offside again. Offside number six against BYU today. 90 seconds left. And a match tied at two. This game will go in the books as a draw if no one scores in the next 100 seconds of play. Ogren restarts from her defensive 18. Past the head of McCarthy. Off the head of Dequilla to Smith. Smith to Hedge. 
quick move by Hedge into the attacking half. Final third. Looks to play Dequilla through. Too strong on the touch. It goes all the way to Davis. Uh, 60 seconds to play. Sabrina to McCarthy. Ball given away to the center part of the park. And Santa Clara possessing straight away with Marika Guay laying off to the midfield. Parcel, left wing Smith. 40 seconds remain. 2-2, BYU and Santa Clara. Hegert back to Smith. Tapping out Lyman. Lyman wants to call off of Santa Clara. No, they're going to give the Broncos the throw. Chance for victory all but vanished here as there are fewer than 30 seconds remaining for BYU. And they need a quick turn here to do something very, very late. Lyman pops it high with 20 seconds to go. It's in the Broncos attacking half. They miss hit out. BYU maybe one final thrust. 15 seconds remaining. And they get a throw from McCarthy. McCarthy targets Flake. It bounces to Elise at 20 yards. 10 seconds to play. At least right side of the area. The Broncos play out for a corner. 5-4. The time will run out. We will end in a draw. 2-2 is our final score. BYU and Santa Clara. Post game recap next here on the new skin. BYU Sports Network.